what excited you most? You know, Francois, we, we briefly touched on the, the black goo that seems to be pouring out of the various orifices on, <laughs> on you in this, on this show. Very unpleasant. Very unsettling. Uh, obviously, I, for one, as a viewer, did not trust those demons to completely exit or vacate the premises at the end of whatever the plan was. You're I was like, smarter man, than Manfred. <laughs> just really rolling the dice here. But uh, whatever it is, I don't know how much you can or can't reveal. As you started to get into how this residual uh, evil or leftover impact was going to manifest itself, was that an exciting thing that you were going to get to tackle? That I mean, totally. One of the most exciting things about Manfred from season one is that I get to play different characters and get out of my comfort zone and go from uh, you know experiencing life as Manfred and then and then just throwing myself into a completely different character for the possession scenes but um um you, the way demon cancer as we should call it affects uh, Manfred uh it's just like uh, I I got to channel um the Jack Nicholson in me <laughs> for the first episode and that was just you know unexpected and amazing.